I did not know Evandro. He simply stopped by the Greenwich House one day and introduced himself. He immediately talked about painting and all the quality difference he would bring to the table. He was compelling. He really knew what he was talking about. So as life has it, he winds up to be the painter at the Greenwich House. Let me introduce you to Evander from Premium Painting. Welcome. Hi, Savia. <laughs> what makes a great paint job? Preparation, preparation, and, and preparation. preparation. And what exactly goes into preparation? Preparation, when you have a house like this, we fill the new house first, then we sand, then we prime again. I know you had a distiller primed already. Yes. We primed it again with oil-based primer. Then uh, we send it again, we cock everything, then we come with the two finished coats. Okay, and we also have two types of materials here. We have the cedar for the body of the house, mm -hmm. and then we have Versatex for the trim. Exactly. This, you gotta make sure if you use the right product for, for the cedar, which is oil-based primer, mm -hmm. and you can go with the latex on top. And the Versatex, you gotta use a latex primer Otherwise, you're going to have a problem later peeling off. So the other day, I watched you paint us in actions with a porch ceiling here. Tell me what they did. It was fun watching. Uh, yeah, it was pretty cool. We have uh, one guy rolling yeah. and two guys brushing right after. That way, we avoid the brushing marks. So that's how you, we do with this kind of ceiling uh, because it's a big ceiling and it looks really nice like you saw. <laughs> it's a great technique and I look closely there. You can't see any brush marks whatsoever. Exactly. It's really, yeah, really it's, nice. Good it's, job. It's really nice. So you're going to show us actually how it's done. Yes, we, we did it the ceiling and the entire house, but we, we're going to show here how we, we did it. Perfect. Rolling and brushing after. Great. Irvin, come on here, show us how it's done. So you take us through it. So the first thing I see is just applying paint, just to put it on heavy. Yeah, on those, those areas yeah. uh, where the roller can't go, yeah. he, uh, he's brushing, and after that he's going to roll. Just like that. So the point here is just to get the paint on there, right? Yeah. Because now I see a lot of edges still, and now he's going to go over with a brush, a right? Brush, yeah. Then we do these uh, two coats, two finish coats. Here we can do just one guy, but on the ceiling, big like that. So we need uh, one guy rolling and two brushing. And it goes pretty fast, actually, yeah, doing this. Because the paint dries, dries fast as well. Oh, so you have to really we go. Have, we have to go, uh, we cannot waste time. Otherwise, you start drying because it's latex. Yeah. Then you start having those marks. So when you go like this, we save a little time and uh, you avoid those brush marks. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. As an artist and a designer, I really do appreciate when people know how to paint. It's more than holding a paintbrush. There's so much more that goes into it. No matter the craftsmanship that goes beforehand, if you don't have a good painter, it does not look good. So appreciate a good painter, and I certainly do. And Evandro, thank you so much. Thank you. Soon to see you on the next project. Thank you, for thank sure. Thank you. <laughs>